Hello everyone, my name is Susan from the Children's Department of the Surrey Libraries. Today we're going to learn a simple project to do with science. You can find all of these ingredients in your kitchen. Give it a try at home. Engineering always starts with a problem to solve. For the gumdrop challenge, the problem is, how can you build a structure with just gumdrops and toothpicks? First, we need to build some simple structures. Okay, now let's try making a triangle. Some shapes are stronger than others. Triangles, for instance, are super stable and can be found in many bridges and houses where extra strength is needed. Even in nature, you find a triangle. Pine trees are generally a triangle-like shape, so they don't topple over when heavy snow falls. You tend to find a lot of pine trees in colder climates for this reason. You might even see a Christmas tree. It's the shape of a triangle. Now, let's try and make a square. When forces are applied to a square, it easily loses its shape and becomes a parallelogram because its connections lack that angled compression unique to triangles. Engineers often add a diagonal through the middle of a square, basically turning it into two triangles and making it stronger. Even hexagons have hidden triangles within their shape that add stability. Here are some other shapes you can try. Now let's try and make a cube shape. We build it from two squares and join the squares together. As you can see, most structures are made from basic shapes. We can expand from there to create a square pyramid on the top, adding more toothpicks together between the gumdrops. Once you've done that, then you can add the triangle at the very top. And at the very top of that, then you can add, see we're forming the triangle right now, then you can add a gumdrop for its stability. Here's some more shapes. All right, now that we've done that, let's try and build a bridge structure. Join along using no more than toothpicks and gumdrops. The structure has to stand firmly on its own. It cannot be propped up, held, or supported from the floor. Notice we made four triangles and started joining them together, first to support the bridge to begin with. Keep joining all the parts together. This is how real bridges are built from basic strong shapes. Add a couple more gumdrops and toothpicks as you complete the structure and make sure all the parts are joined for full structural strength. This takes a while as you can see. Keep adding toothpicks to complete it and forming more triangles. So what makes a triangle so strong? The triangle can hold large loads. Now we're gonna add, after all the toothpicks are done, we're gonna add some books to the top to see how strong this bridge structure actually is. We added five altogether. Now try a tall structure. Have fun. Hi again, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this science video. We'll see you again. Bye.